Amazon were kind enough to send me an item from KNF. This is a macro filter for the DJI Osmo Pocket 3, which I'm actually filming on. So uh, you can see there what we've got. Let me just show you, uh, I've actually got an Osmo Action 5, which I'm going to be doing some filming with. So using product showcase mode, mode uh, we can get reasonably close. You can see that, that's in focus. That's only a few inches away from the camera, but a little bit closer and it will go blurred. Somewhere about there. So what I'm going to do is put this on, have a look, see what kind of results we get, and then uh, give you a, a sort of a wrap-up summary at the end. Now, I would say that although I was sent this for free, nobody can tell me what to say on this. I'm not getting paid for this. It's basically just a pure review, my own thoughts. If it's great, I'll tell you. If it's lousy, I'll tell you. I hate this packaging. Always so much. Uh, now, it's nicely packaged, as you would expect from KNF. That tends to be uh, one of the things they're good at, the packaging. So let's have a look. Far too much packaging, in my opinion. But that's a minor detail. I'm going to just throw things about and get this big case. That's interesting. They also send you a screen protector, you might be able to see that, for the uh, main screen of the Osmo. I'll keep that safe. I do have one on. I'll just put that away safe. Uh, and this is the actual macro filter. So I'm going to show you this with the normal product showcase mode. And you can see tiny. Magnetic, so we're going to see how that works in a moment. So you remember what we did with the action. I got it quite close and it goes out of focus. What are we saying about there? Let's have a look. So if I pop this on here, I'm out of focus now, but let's have a look at this Osmo action, how close we can get. So we're going to be, this is definitely macro, so you've got to get really, really close. Wow. Wow. So let me just put something else up here. Uh, this is a KNF battery uh, equivalent for the NW, what is it, the Fuji NPW126. So let's show you the writing on that. And I'll hold that as steady as I can so you can see how sharp it is. That's pretty close, I must say. Do we get any closer now? So that seems to be the maximum. Uh, which is, is that, that's about the full size, take this off for a second, that's about the full size of that battery is filling the full frame. Um, this is pretty solid, feels really good, hefty, weighty, there's a lot of glass in this, put it back on, just connects dead simple. Uh, let me see the back of my hand, all my wrinkles. Yeah, so you can see the kind of uh, quality you get there, the kind of close-upness you get there, if that's a word, uh, and it, it definitely feels a quality item, I've got to say. Uh, I would prefer something a little bit smaller to carry it in than that, but that's very protective for sure. Uh, and if you ever need to do macro, so it might be flower photography or whatever, or just for special effects, or if you're doing very close-up of product reviews, which I do sometimes, um, so I've got this item that I might want to show close-ups on, closer than that, out of focus again, yeah. So we might want to look at individual parts of a product, that would be great for that. On the box it does say macro 20 to 40 mil, and I'm not sure what that means, quite honestly, uh, whether that means how far away you are. Cleaning cloth, I'll keep that safe as well. With the actual filter. So what do I think of it? Well I'm gonna have a look on playback but looking on the screen that looked sharp to me, it was certainly close. I've got to say I think that was a pretty good item and for anybody who needs macro on the Osmo Pocket 3 that's a really cool little item and KNF generally have great quality. I've had a lot of different items from over the years. I've had some tripods and different other things. Um, I've got this battery for the Fuji, um, all, all genuine, genuinely consistently good. I've got to say, I would think that's five stars. See you later.